going to be talking about my October favorites and I know you're looking at this video and you're like but wait it's Monday and you should be talking about your nails but I was not inspired by anything to like do any like type of design or anything so I just painted them normal and the color that I used which I am obsessed with um, it is the name Cynthia by Julep. There we go. It's just like this nice nudie color with these little gold reflexes. It's not big chunks of gold. It's just very, very fine, like dusty glitter gold in there. And it's just amazing. I love it. Just love this color. <laughs> but I, I can't remember if I got this at the end of October or if I got this this month. So I'm not really counting this in my favorites. I'm just letting you know what I have on my nails. <laughs> But I'm going to be talking about skincare, one thing for my hair, one thing for makeup, and then smell good, and then something extra. So let's just get started. Is what I use to clean my face. I have recently been using this Olay Regenerous Micro Purifying Foaming Cleanser right here, and I love it. Um, it is very, very gentle. I don't believe there's any salicylic acid in this or benzoyl peroxide and I actually like that because when I use face washes with either salicylic acid or a, well benzoyl peroxide hmm, kind of but mainly salicylic acid in a face wash it breaks me out so I have to it has to be like clear of both of those things it just has to be just straight gentle goodness and I have been using this all month and I absolutely Love it. I got it from Did I get this from CVS? Or did I get this from Ulta? You can find it from either one because I've seen it in both places. But I'm just gonna go on a limb and say CVS. But I seen it in Ulta and I seen it in CVS. So you can get it in either place. Do -do. Boop, boop. And the next thing that I got is for your face, and I know I got this from Ulta. Now this does have salicylic acid in it, but it's okay because it's not a face wash. It's just like a spot treatment. It is the Mario Badescu Drying Lotion. And it's right here. I got this from Ulta, so I know where I got this one from. And this does have salicylic acid as well as sulfur. So it kind of smells funny. It smells like a volcano on your face. But it has two different little components in there if you can see that there's the solution right here that's actually going to be killing the stuff and getting rid of all that nastiness on your face and then you have the little pink stuff on the bottom which is calamine lotion you know like when we had like when you were little and you had either chicken pox or you had mosquito bites and your mom would rub all that on your body so you could stop itching and it could just like calm the skin well, that's why they put it on your face, so your face, so the, the pimple can calm down while that little liquidy solution can get it. So I love this. It's just spot treatment, so I've only used a little bit. And you don't want to shake it up. You just want to take a Q-tip and dip all the way down and pull it all the way up. And then you'll have the little pink stuff with the, with the, with the liquid on there and you just ding, 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 just spot. And I get so excited because each night... I have less and less spots that I have to put on my face, so I count them. And, and then sometimes I get kind of worked up when I have more spots on my face. Because one day I only had to put four little dots on my face, like two on this side and two on this side. And then one day I had like ten dots all over my face. I was like, why is my face breaking out? This is the best part of being a woman. Yeah, we break out during that time of the month. Sucks. Now the next thing that I have. Well, this is kind of for my face too. This is like, it's not a makeup, but it's a makeup tool. And this is by Sigma. And this is the E45 Small Tapered Blending Brush. And I love it. And it's like shaped like a little dome. So it like comes up like that and then it points at the top. I kid you not. If you are on a budget and you've never tried Sigma brushes before and you're like, I want to try Sigma brushes, but either they're too expensive or I get overwhelmed on their website and I don't know what to get. You should get this brush if you want to try out Sigma and you only can only get one eye brush this brush you can apply everything with this brush you can right now I don't have any um, eyeshadow on but if I did and if I wanted to use this brush you can tap inside of your your eyeshadow and pat your um 
your eyeshadow on. Then you can go inside of the crease and blend. And then you can take this little part on the um, on the end and go like this on your outer V and then blend that in. And then you can use a little dot right there and then just put the little highlight right there in the inner corner. Child, I'm telling you, this brush can apply all of your makeup on. I think that there should be like a tag where you should be able to put makeup on with one brush. It's great. Next thing is going to be for hair. I haven't been really falling in love with any hair products that I already that I haven't already mentioned before in my channel, so I don't want to be repetitive and keep talking about the same thing over and over and over again. So, um, but this I haven't really talked about this. I think I I showed this in a haul a long time ago, but this is amazing, and it's this. <laughs> this is a head massage. Oh my god, this thing is amazing. Okay, you know hair grows out of your scalp. And you have to eat properly and everything, but you also have to stimulate your scalp. So you have to stimulate the blood flow to your scalp so that the nutrients can get to your hair, to the, to the, you know, to the root, and then your hair will grow. This thing can put you to sleep. Oh my gosh. Mmm. I really like it. And I'm, and I'm using it more now than I was before because I had just put it in my little hair supply box and never use it and then I took it out and I was like oh my gosh I'm gonna use it forever now. That's it for like hair and face. Now I'm gonna talk about smell good like scents. I'm gonna talk about so something that you put on your body and something that you spray in the air. Okay you guys know that I love the candle um, mahogany teak wood from Bed Bath I was about to say Bed Bath & Beyond from Bath & Body Works. Everybody does that. Everybody makes that mistake on that store. Okay so I use a candle, but now, girl, I use the spray. And this is the Mahogany Teakwood Room Spray. So, you know, if you don't feel like burning a candle, which I actually have the candle burning right there. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, you can see it right here. Bam, right there. And then you have this spray right here. It's like, goodness. Mm. Love it. Now the other thing is what I smell like. For the last month, I have been smelling like this fragrance. And this is the Unbreakable Bond by Chloe and Lamar. This is a unisex perfume. Wait. Oh man, that's why I like it so much. Oh. Hold on. Hmm. Not really, I was about to say they kind of smelt alike, but not really, but kinda. If you kinda, but not really. It, it has that masculine, but a female can use it too. Like I love it. You, it's just no words. It's just great. A guy can wear this, and a girl can wear this because this is a unisex perfume. I think when you call it unisex, I think you call it a cologne. You don't call it a perfume. So this unisex cologne. Another one that I like is um, CK One. Hmm. That smells good too. But this month I've been using this a lot and I am absolutely obsessed. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Now last but not least, I am going to talk about um, two extra things that I've been loving. And those are my iPhone cases. And I'm obsessed with iPhone cases now. I just collect them. I go on Amazon, I go on eBay, I go in the store and I just get everything. And the two that I've been using interchangeably are these two. It is my cassette tape, one right here, and I actually did a, I actually put a picture up on Instagram of my hair and I had this and some people were like, why is she holding a cassette tape? It wasn't a cassette tape, it was the case to my cell phone. So I have this one and then I also have the Game Boy one and since my phone is black, like the face of my iPhone is black, I got the black um, Game Boy because they do have one in white, they have one in pink, blue, they have them all crazy colors, but I just got the black one, you know, it's so fun. And people always be like, oh, those are so cute, like, Wah. I love it. And they're so easy to just pop one and off, see, just take it off. There's no hardness to have to be worried about because I had this one case from um, Tory Burch. <gasps> That thing is so freaking hard to take off. Oh, oh my gosh, you know nobody ain't stealing that from you. But see, I put it on my phone that quick. 
so that one I guess I guess this week I'll keep I'll keep my my Game Boy on I try to change them like once a week or twice a, or change them like twice a week but yeah 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 I'm absolutely loving it uh, that is all that I have today I know that it was a really quick video I really didn't have much favorites but the things that I did have I just wanted to make sure that I showed them to you guys so I hope you guys are having a wonderful day afternoon night whenever time you're watching this video because I am putting it up on Monday so um, I will see you guys next time. 